Uncle Sam wants you not to watch this video if you are prone to seizures caused by flashing lights. Hey guys, JPEX Alarm 101 from Life Safety Signaling Design here, and I thought I would do System Test 19 and a half just for fun. I've got new devices up and stuff, but uh, you know, I wanted to display my wonderful video taking from a tripod. I also wanted to show you what happens at the panel from the enunciator. So, I'll be operating the system from the enunciator, but you'll be seeing the control panel while I do that. So let's go ahead and have a look at the devices for System Test 19 and a half. Right over here, we have the Mircom MS501 ADU, formerly addressable, now conventional, pull station. You can see that we have the 404U, the Mircom MS404U. Let's start by activating the Mircom MS404U and see what happens at the control panel. Now you'll notice that the alarms are not sounding. Why is that? Let's have a look at what the panel says. That's right. That zone 3 is set as priority 2. I chose to custom label it priority 2. But there's an interesting feature that the control panel now has. I am now able to map zones to outputs. I mapped zone 3 to only alarm the relay, the programmable relay. I mapped zone 1 to only sound the NAX. And I mapped zone 2, which is the smoke detector, to sound both. Zone 4 is also set to sound both. Now I'm going to go over and I will reset the Mircom MS-404U, as you can see there. So that is reset, and we can now reset the panel, which I will be doing from the enunciator. After I get my camera to focus in on the display. <laughs> All right. Oh, right. I forgot about the bug. Priority 2 does not allow you to reset from the enunciator. Alright. Now let's demonstrate the panel's ability for fire alarm purposes. You knew that sounded familiar. Look at that. Let's go ahead and silence. Alright, the system is silenced. Now let's go ahead and reset the control panel. Now we will demonstrate the I3. As you can see, So let's go ahead and go up there, and we'll be testing the i3. Now the panel goes into pre-signal.
Hopefully you can see that. I don't know how well you can see it. That should be better. See, the panel says general alarm. As you can see, there is the Commander 3 and the UMMT, both silenced. The horn is not being utilized on the UMMT as it is not wired up. Let's go, ahead, let's go ahead and give the system a reset. But, I want to show you the light on the i3 and hopefully you can see it from here. I don't know how well you were able to see the light go out on the i3, but I'm hoping it was okay. Alright, last but not least we will do a fire drill from the enunciator. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching my video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe so people just like you can see my videos too. I'm GPEX Alarm 101 from Life Safety Signaling Design, signing out until next time.